Welcome to Loy Cretong. This is the Thai festival. It pays homage to the water and river goddess. It happens on the 12th month of the lunar Thai calendar, the full moon. Everybody comes out with a basket. It's called a Cretong, and you float it down the river into a waterway on a pond. It is absolutely beautiful, absolutely stunning. We're going to check it out today. Come along for the journey. This is Suan Lumpini School, and they're obviously organizing the Catan sales. It's located inside Lumpini Park. Very nice location for a school. Okay, I got a Catan. We're gonna float it over here in Lumpini Park in the canal. Don't worry, it's made of banana leaves. It's biodegradable. It's not going to damage any of the pond or the river or the mini lake, and it's a nice charitable cause. Uh, so they got a little mini pageant going on here at the school. I love the openness and friendliness of everybody. Everybody's smiling. And they've got lots of food over here, too. Any festival in Thailand, you're going to have a lot of food. I might have to check out some of this food a little bit later. I am getting a little bit hungry. But first, we'll float the ball. Hello. Fish are? Aloy, my. What do we have here? Oh, chicken. We do this one first. Kapunka. Hello. Hello. We have more tongs at the entrance. There's lots of them. Very easy to get. You gotta yell louder to get the most attention. The weather's perfect right now. It's the end of November. There are so many holidays here in Thailand. They celebrate all the Thai holidays and you also get all the Western holidays. So we got Christmas decorations everywhere. In the middle of Loi Kratong, we had Halloween. You get a lot of holidays here in Thailand. I love the attitude towards holidays. It's a full moon, it's a beautiful night. Everybody's out and they bring a basket. It's called a kratong. You have to float it in a body of water, a lake, a river, a man-made lake. You'll see so many smiles, so many happy faces. And I got myself a kratong. I'm gonna join in the festivities. There's a lot of people here, but this is a very, very big park. And so you're not really crowded. Everybody's pushing out their kratongs, but everybody has good space. And yeah, it's a beautiful sight. You can see the whole circle. They designate certain areas for kratong so that they can clean them up afterwards. So a lot of the water you can't put a kratong, but in this section you can, and it is a very large section. So you can see the whole expanse of this little mini man-made lake covered in kratongs on the side. There's a little bonfire kratong over there. Down at the water, and you can see there are beautiful cretongs floating all around me. It's a stunning sight. I hope it looks as good on camera as it does in person. It is amazing. There's a candle in every cretong, so it's got a nice orange hue. Yeah, very magical. There goes the kratong. You make a wish when you put the kratong in the, the water. I think you gotta keep it secret, but I'm not sure. It reminds me of Pinocchio and the shooting star. You make a wish on a shooting star. You make a wish when you blow out your birthday candles, and you make a wish when you push out your kratong. Happy Loi Kratong. I hope you all had a great one too.